basketball royalty was in our very own backyard yesterday. Magic Johnson made his way to the West Philly Y to share a message about RSV, which is a respiratory virus that impacts thousands of Americans. NBC 10 sat down with Magic for this exclusive interview to talk health, Sixers star Joel Embiid, and much more. Matt Zalusha has the story. Let us extend a warm welcome for Magic Johnson. Basketball Hall of Famer Irvin Magic Johnson back in Philly. Now, he wasn't making magic on the court. Instead, he was sharing a health message about RSV. RSV is a common contagious virus that uh, now is affecting adults 60 and old, older, and they should educate themselves about it. My health is top priority. As you know, 32 years I've been living with HIV. Magic's well-known battle with HIV makes learning more about RSV that much more important to him. It's helped me to live a healthier lifestyle and to understand what I should be looking out for. No, Magic wasn't teaming with Dr. J. Instead, it was Dr. Len Friedman, a pediatrician and RSV specialist. In the United States, for people over 65, 177,000 adults are estimated to be hospitalized every year due to RSV. That's why Magic spent the day in Philly promoting health awareness. Magic won three MVP awards in his day. Now the Sixers reigning MVP award winner, Joel Embiid, he's dealing with health problems of his own. Staying healthy has been a huge problem for Joel in his NBA career. And Magic has this message for Sixers fans. I think you just got to say, listen, get to the playoff and i think that if he he can get to the playoff and be healthy this team got a chance to do something special that would be good news for sixers owner josh harris josh hasn't won a title with the sixers and this past year he partnered with a group that includes magic to take over the washington commanders magic says despite the added workload the sixers owner has the ability to handle both roles i would say to all Sixers fans don't worry about josh he's going to be fine he wants a championship so bad. And see, he's close. We have to build our organization with the commanders. He's closer to winning a championship here, right, with the Sixers. So uh, we're going to be, he's going to be fine. And then on the commanders, we'll be fine. We have to look up to your egos and cowboys right now. We're trying to get to where they are. So we're trying to build it, right? Matt Delusha, NBC 10 News.